Oregon State stayed on pace for its worst men's basketball season in school history after Arizona State whipped the Beavers 73-53 Saturday night in Tempe, Arizona. OSU was never in it, as Arizona State had a double-digit lead nine minutes into the game. The Beavers, 3-22, 1-13, lost their 13th consecutive game. Only seven Oregon State scholarship players dressed for the game, as forward Warathalade Shea was unable to play. The Beavers have lost 10 of their last 11 games by double figures. Oregon State's worst season based on winning percentage was 1995-96, when the Beavers went 4-23, The Beavers' win percentage this season is .120. OSU has five regular season and at least one Pac-12 tournament game remaining this season. Oregon State's Glenn Taylor Jr. posted his first career double-double with 14 points and 10 rebounds. Deshaun Davis scored 13 points for the Beavers. Arizona State, 10-15, 6-9, had five players score in double figures, led by Marion Jackson with 15. The Sun Devils forced 19 OSU turnovers. This is the only game between Arizona State and Oregon State this regular season. The eight previous ASU OSU games prior to Saturday were decided by a collective 22 points, with the largest winning margin 6 points. Only briefly during the first half was there a hint this game would be as close as the previous eight. Arizona State jumped to a 10-2 lead, increasing it to 29-13 with 8-27 left before halftime. But the Beavers made a move as five points from Glenn Taylor Jr. triggered a 14-4 run to close the deficit to 33-27. Arizona State didn't flinch. The Sun Devils scored nine of the half's final 11 points to take a 42-29 halftime lead. Asu scored the first five points of the second half to take its largest lead at 47-29. The Sun Devils continued to pour it on, leading by as many as 26 points with 5.30 remaining before coasting to the finish. Next up for Oregon State are the final three home games of the season, beginning Thursday against USC.